everybody. We saw Star Wars yesterday, The Last Jedi, and it was awesome. I loved it. But I'm not going to give any spoilers, but there was some new ships and stuff. And it was awesome from beginning to end. So I give it two thumbs up. That's not really how I rate stuff, but it sounds good. So I don't feel quite right today. I feel like my blood pressure's up, but I don't I don't know. Anyway, Bobby and Dave's coming over and we're gonna make some cookies maybe. Hopefully. So we'll see how that goes. Hello! We're going, we're making cookies. Dave is in the other room mixing. Oh, I should show you. Let's go for a walk. Well, first, can I show you, Bobby, looking at your video, your cell phone? He's looking at things on his phone because he wants, because we all love YouTube, right, Bobby? What's going on? We all love YouTube, right? Cause you're watching YouTube. What's that? Talk. Tell me. Tell you about the address. Is that what you said? No, I didn't say that. I'm going now. Look, this is one of the paintings that my middle son made for art class, and that's another one over there. He gave it to me, and then he made this one, which somebody in his art class said that he 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 makes voodoo bananas. I guess because his bananas looked better than anybody else's. I don't know. And he is colorblind. And here we see the gentlemen doing their baking. Making the morning cake. No, that's from Maurice Sundak. So anyway, making Crisco cookies. I'm supervising. He's supervising because it's his equipment. And Dave is baking because he's my handy dandy arms and hands. Where'd the recipe go? Oh, I think we're mixing in with the dough. <laughs> did you? I wanted to show it. Did I? I didn't pick it up, did I? I can't show it. It's a secret. Oh, it's a secret recipe that Crisco came out with a long time ago. Yeah, I haven't seen it anywhere since then. Well, here's some recipes from Crisco. I wonder if it's on here. Let's see. This has pie crust, ultimate chocolate chip cookies, and creamy I'm walnut oatmeal cookies. I'm gonna have to use the paddles. Yeah, we're not making any of those. It's not, it's not hooking up. So the dough, dough hook was not hooking up. Do you think the paddle's gonna work? This yeah. is something that's hard to do with hands. Eat it. This mm -hmm. isn't even doing. It's enough. not. It's not enough. It's not. Um, it's not elastic enough to grab it. So. Oh. The paddle will so work. So it's better for. It's better for bread dough, not cookie dough. Yeah. I mean. You're getting this straight, straight from the cook's mouth. Huh. <laughs> Look at it again. It's me and Dave. Oh. Dave, <laughs> look, we're making cookies. Bob was making cookies too, but now he's destroying civilizations. Are you destroying civilizations? Yeah, yeah. Yep, yeah, um, so, what? Korea and the um, Iroquois um, are going to go bye-bye. I mean, he's playing Civ. Civ what? Six? Civ five. Civ five. I don't like Civ enough. It's six enough to get out of there. He didn't, yeah. He's had every civilization game, and how many hours do you have on some of them? Well, this one I have... 11, 1100, which is not that much. I, I have over 20,000 on Civ 4. He has over 20,000 hours on Civ 4. Some of the most boring games you'll ever <laughs> see in your life. Look at it. Look at this. this is the kind of action you can expect on Civ 5. Look at that. He's taking over countries. I mean, to me, it's enjoyable for a couple hours and then I'm done. Like, forever I'm done after that. Well, anyway, I should go because I'm supposed to be helping. I'm not helping. I'm making videos and disturbing people. Right. We got some snickerdoodle cookies cooling off. And let's see if you can see them. And there's the oatmeal raisin cookies. And then here's some dough for what is that called? The scotch cookies. We're gonna we're letting it wait a little bit because we need the oven to get cooler. Oh look, here's a coffee mug, for, a coffee cup from Wawa. Oh, oh, some of our dinner is showing. So this is what the Scotch cookies look like that my husband calls plastic cookies. Let's look over here. Passing Dave. 
So here's what they look like up close. It's more like a candy, I think. Kind of tastes like caramel. And here he's putting a fresh batch off, taking a, like you have to let them cool for three minutes. Woo, I had an instant swivel there. And this is what the dough looks like for those scotch cookies before they turn into cookies. We we use a um, quarter teaspoon, oh, half teaspoon, I'm sorry. We use a half teaspoon uh, measuring spoon and take some stuff. I think I should be out of your way. And roll it into a ball. I, I rolled a bunch of them in the balls. And then Dave is going to place them on the cookie sheet with the parchment pa paper. He's really fast because he used to be a cook. I mean, he was a... Look, he worked in a restaurant. I don't know all the right words. So, I guess as you've seen, it's mostly been a cookie day. We baked a bunch of cookies. This is just one of the kinds that you saw. That one's the Snickerdoodles. Um, also, Bob's car didn't start today. Oops. Bob's car didn't start today. It, um, it wouldn't start, so Dave and, Dave and Bob um, did a jump start on the car, and then they drove it over to the garage that fixes our cars so hopefully they'll get to look at it tomorrow because we don't know if the battery just drained or something is wrong so they'll get a look at that and I guess it's uh, about eight days before Christmas right now I just want to put some stockings up still and wrap some presents and other than that, no pressure, right? <laughs> so, that's all I got for today. I hope everybody's having a good day. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye.